here. This is your weekend to dress up in your favorite cosplay. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. In today's page turners, the Urbana Free Libraries Fan Con. Um, we're talking about that today with Lauren Chambers, the programming and outreach manager. Okay, what 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 is a cosplay? <laughs> I guess that's my first question. I should have read that. Before. So cosplay is when people dress up in costume. It may be their favorite character. It may be an original character. If they play games like Dungeons and Dragons, it could be the character that they play there. Oh, oh. gotcha. So the Urbana Library is hosting fan con and yes. this is how many years have you been doing this this is the fourth year that we've been doing a, a small convention at the library it's uh, this year it's gonna be August 10th from 11 to 4 so that's a Saturday um, and we have a lot of different events planned we have a trivia contest um, we're doing a speed drawing contest for people uh, what do they got? What are they, what are they drawing? So it's going to be there are going to be two parts to it. They can do an original character and they'll have a little bit of time to draw one. And then we do a second half where people can draw a scene. And oh. there are prizes for both. Okay. And um, the trivia, mm -hmm. they have to know their comics, I'm guessing? Comics, movies, TVs, everything is fair game. Oh. Anime, yeah. Okay. We pull from everything for that. Well, it looks like you brought a little bit of everything here today on the table. So why don't we start with some of the books here in the front? We've got Star yes. Wars on the on the table here. Mm -hmm. And tell me about some of these other ones. So this is actually a book for costume making and cosplay. Oh, the Heroes so we, Closet. Yeah, we have a couple different ones of these at the library, so I brought I brought it out to show people that if you don't have something yet uh, that you would want to wear, they're still trying to try and make something. Oh. And we have some materials that can help you with that. So for our little fashion designers out there who, yes. who are crafty with sewing, okay? Much better sewers than I am. Oh my goodness, the Stranger Things. Of course, everyone's on that season mm -hmm. three kick right now. So if you haven't, you finished season three and you don't know what to do next, there's Stranger Things comics. And then there's also this, which is just about Stranger Things. Okay, fun. And then Chicks Dig Time Lords. What's yes. A, what this time? So this is about Doctor Who. Okay. So if you love that show, and actually the editor for this, Lynn Thomas, is going to be speaking at FanCon. Fantastic. She's a seven-time Hugo Award winner, um, and she's won things for podcasts, magazines, and books like this. Wow. So she's going to be talking about fandom and what else you can do with it. Okay. And then I've got Mouse Guard here, which is, this is a little different. It's actually a comic, but this is a role-playing game. So it's a tabletop game that you can In do. In book form. Yes. So this huh. just has the rules, and then you can check it out, learn the rules, and play it. Now, we've also got some games here on the table. Mm -hmm. um, are these also for checking out? These are, yeah. The library has a board game collection and a video game collection. And for FanCon, we'll have a board game room and a video game room. For video games, we'll have um, Switch, PS4, and I believe Wii are the ones we're planning to have. People can come and play, and everything is completely free. Wow. You don't have to sign up ahead of time. You just show up that day. If you come in costume, we are going to have our first ever meetup where everyone in cosplay can be in one place, and we're going to get a group photo. Oh, <laughs> this sounds so fun. For those people who, you know, may not be familiar with the whole Comic-Con, you know, mm -hmm. scene, this is kind of like a little version. Is that right? Exactly. They can come check it out. They don't have to pay fees that some of the, the bigger comms have. Um, we started this because people were saying that they wanted to be able to go to a con, but it could be too expensive or they were too far away. So we thought, we'll hold our own. We can we'll do hold, it. Yeah, we'll hold a small con and then people can still get that sort of experience and they can have the fun of getting to meet other people that like what they like or discovering new things and just celebrating all the geeky stuff that they really love. <laughs> She said it, not me. Okay. I am so, a geek. I will freely <laughs> admit it. So this is really open to anyone of any age that just has a love for comics and games mm -hmm. and this kind of... We'll have stuff. an area for small children. We call it ChibiCon, which just basically means kind of okay. miniature small in Japanese. You were throwing out so many different words at me that I'm just like, <laughs> they're over my head. So there will be places if you if you're family and you want to bring your kids, we'll have activities for kids as well. Okay. And let's remind everybody what it is. It is Saturday, August 10th from 11 to 4. All right, it's time to get your costume ready and make plans to attend the fourth annual fan con happening at the Urbana Free Library. There's a look at their website. We've got all the information at stayliving.tv.